Hello, I'm Ronny Barnoff from K2. Today we will show you our solutions for standing seam roofs and metal roof systems. Therefore, I have brought you an expert, Christian Fürholzer from Solid Sea. Also, hello, my name is Christian Fürholzer from Solid Sea. We develop and produce seam clamps for metal roofs, and we want to present you today the solutions for the metal roofs in connections with K2. First, we want to talk about crafted roof types like roofs with a double folded standing seam or a single folded standing seam, and afterwards about profiled roof types. Yeah, profiled roof types, for example, with a round seam, which might come from manufacturers like Bemo or um, Calzip. Calzip, thank you. <laughs> Or also uh, special profiles from manufacturers like Domico, Zambelli, Lysect with clip lock and so on. Those might have a larger or smaller regional meaning. Here you see a typical double folded standing seam roof. This roof type is normally mounted on boards and the metal sheets are fixed with stainless steel clips at least every 50 centimeters. For fixing the single rail from K2, we use the C-Fix standing seam clamps and fix them with a set screw at the seam. Please tighten the set screw with a torque of 18 Newton meters. As the clips of the double seam and the single seam are not that strong, it is important to keep a certain distance with the clamp from the seam. This is not as important uh, for the round seam and the other system metal roofs uh, because there the clips are much stronger. In most cases you won't know the exact position of the clips but uh, with a closer look, you might be able to recognize where the clips are because those positions are slightly brighter or slightly darker or um, they are just looking a little different because of the um, dirt which is gathering there. With our clamps for seam roofs or metal roof systems, we can install our modules portray or also landscape with a two-layer system. The clamps are extensively tested on several roof profiles. Based on these tests, we got a general DIBT approval for the clamps and the load capacity can be used in the base system of K2. Yeah, of course, you can plan your PV project with our calculation tool K2 Base and also print and create your static report of the project. Of course, on a double seam roof, you can also use our solid rail. This one has a channel on the bottom side and therefore can be used in connection with a T-bolt. Uh, the T-bolt is inserted in this S5 clamp or in this stainless seam clamp. Uh, the stainless seam clamp also is compatible with a copper roof. Um, as you might know, copper and aluminium don't like each other too much, so the stainless steel clamp is one solution, but also the aluminium clamps can be used on copper roof, but then you need an additional part, a so-called inlay, which uh, is, so to speak, a border between aluminium and copper, so they don't touch each other and there is no corrosional effect. Here we have a sample of a single folded roof. The single fold, the brother of the double fold, is also a handcrafted roof type. For fixing mounting systems for PV, we use our C-Fix clamp for snap lock and single folded seams. Put the clamp over the seam 
and tighten the screw. And again, this one is to be used with our single rail, um, which is easily to be fixed uh, by sliding the little part on the top, which is uh, very close to our climber. That's it. And again, for the single folded seam, we also have a solution with our solid rail. And as an additional part, you need an adapter plate here. And as we know, the solid rail is to be fixed from the bottom with a T-bolt. And the same clamps that we have just seen for the single folded seam, um, we can also use it for this snap seam. Again, solid rail and single rail. So we now come to the next seam type. Um, as far as I know, Christian, this one is uh, quite different from the ones we've seen until now. So what's that kind of seam and what's the difference? Here we have a sample of a roof with a bulb or round seam. Typical producers of roofs with that seam type are Kelsip, Bimo, Kingsip and others. But as well we have a clamp solution for this type of seam. This C-fix clamp with a climber which is suitable for the single rail of K2. You put the clamp on the seam, screw the screw, tighten the screw with the head and afterwards the screw on the opposite side and fix the rail with the climber. And again, we do have two more solutions for the connection of a solid rail, also for the round seams. One solution would be the stainless steel clamp, which you can see here, and again, aluminum clamp from S5. The special thing about the S5 clamp is that it comes in two parts, and this insert uh, is to be um, added after you put the clamp over the seam, like this. Then you fasten the screw, that's it. So let's now talk about some special metal roof systems. Here are three models of the manufacturer Sambelli. The first one is the Rib roof 465 with this clamp, original Sambelli clamps, all the three of them. Then the second one would be the Speed 500, very similar clamp, but um, you can recognize it because it's asymmetrical. And the third one is a special round seam, uh, the Zambelli Evolution. And all of these clamps are compatible with our solid rail. So here we can see our K2 rib clamp KL. This is the old version or the nowadays version and this will be the future version, uh, the old version with a channel for our mini clamps or you can also attach a solid rail again with a T-bolt. Uh, the future version comes with a little multi-rail on top, so it's compatible with our universal one mid or one end clamp. All right, um, very exciting question in the end. Christian, what do you think about uh, elevated systems on seam roofs or metal system roofs? Well, we have chances to realize such systems on metal roofs. Mm -hmm. If you are in the status of new buildings, and you bring in the additional loads in the calculation of the roof. From the beginning From on. the beginning. At existing roofs, it's much more difficult. Mm -hmm. And uh, please take a static engineer for calculation. So it's not possible always. You must have a clear um, 
static calculation. calculation. Yes. Yeah. And then you might be able to do it. Yes. So that was it for today's video about seam clamps. Um, thank you very much for joining, for watching. Thank you very much, Christian, for supporting us today with the very interesting support, very helpful support and very interesting input. Thanks, that Thank I could you show you. Goodbye. Goodbye.